Hey guys, how's it going? So here is a, another challenge that I'm not sure if anyone else has done. I know um, another a, a simmer had done something similar, but the mine has different rules and it's kind of a different storyline. So mine is the Wayward Teens Challenge. Hmm. And we're going to meet the characters here in a second. But, um, teens that are homeless are in trouble. Billionaire Luke Matthews, who is right here, and I don't know why the trades didn't stick, and his wife Tori will take them in, care for them, help them find jobs, help them find their way. The rules are the houses must be small, giving them the necessity, necessities they need, plus some luxuries. Each teen will have 10,000 10, simoleons to spend on decorating their home with guidance from Tori. The walls and the floors only may be changed in the bedroom. They must keep their... They must keep good grades in order to keep the luxuries, you know, fighting with others, etc., etc. You can only control one team for 24 hours, then move on to the next, yeah. and then so on and so forth. We must help a total of a hundred teens, but it's not so bad when you, let me finish the rules. If I seem, if I seem, I seem, I seem, seem, seem. If a Sim keeps their good grade, their grade average of an A for one week, they can be, a, they can have their birthday. And then once the Sim age is up, they move out, you add a new one in. Luke and Tori may speak with the kids, get to know them, give them advice, but are not allowed to help them with their homework. The only cheat that may be used is BB move objects. Mm -hmm. And, each teen must have different traits. So, let me go ahead and go, and yes, I do have a lot more, and I downloaded a lot more. Uh, where is, oh, come on, I know I downloaded the workaholic, the workaholic trait. I know I downloaded it. I know I did. But now it doesn't seem to be here. Fudge monkeys. That is just not cool. That is not hecking cool at all. Because it was on here. <laughs> it must have been the one that they taken off. <laughs> but that's okay. Because we will give them... Okay, he is self-assured for definitely being a billionaire. So this is Luke Matthews, which, ironically, Luke and Tori Matthews are actually taking, taken, um, these characters are actually taken from <coughs> one of the first books that, my first book that I wrote and published. So, it's definitely a... <laughs> It's definitely a pretty awesome thing to do. For, and so, here's Tori. Isn't she just a doll? I mean, look at her. She is so heckin' cute! And then we're going to meet Christy. She is a painter extraordinaire, a muser. She is an artistic prodigy, and she's creative. And so they each have their own houses. <clears throat> Wait, I remember why he was supposed to be a jock. And I think that one got taken out too. I think definitely think I definitely think that one got taken out as well. Dang it. Man, oh my good ones got taken out. No! That is so not hecking cool. Okay, so he's a bodybuilder, high metabolism, he's immature, and he's hot headed. <laughs> Harrison Britt is, he definitely was, 
his parents really did not care for his hot-headedness. They didn't know what to do with him, and so he ran away, and that's when Luke and Tori found him. April Minor. She is, she wants to be fabulously wealthy, business savvy. She is a drama queen. Well, we shouldn't have her as at peace. But we should have her as a, um, perfectionist. Mm. So this is April. Her parents wanted her to go in, to go some, to do something else, but she wants to become, she wants to do fashion. She wants to be in fashion. So <laughs> that is why she is here. Reese Barnhart, such a handsome looking man. He is a computer whiz, a quick learner, he's Asperger's, and he's paranoid. <laughs> His parents didn't know how to deal with him, and so the state took him, the state took him, <laughs> child services took him, and then he ran away from there. And then that and then Luke and Tori found him. Michelle Underwood. She wants to be a master chef. Essence of flavor. She is a gamer. And she is socially awkward. Now, this one. Th this one is actually very special because this one. I had. Not just made up. My youngest monkey made this one up. He decided to. He wanted to be a part of one of my challenges, so this is perfect. So he designed this character, the whole mohawk, blue hair. He picked Public Enemy, Dastardly, ADHD, and a music lover. So you can definitely tell why his parents left him, or he left being away from his parents and everything because oh my gosh <laughs> yeah so let's go ahead and get into this like I said it's really gonna it's really easy if we can get their grades up and st keep them up for a week to, to have their birthdays and age up now I'll show you their houses and everything they each have their own house which I am still not sure why it put them over there when they should be over here but anyways, we'll start with, since I'm on Christopher, this, well, okay, first off, let's do this, let's do this, this is Luke and Tori's house, of course, the big man, the big mansion, but everything, this is their house, and I am not for sure why that is there. But we will go ahead and hecking remove it. But we have a pool here. And these are the small houses I was talking about. We've got two over here. And we've got four over here. So let's go ahead and, oops, let's go ahead and get into it. This is Christopher's house. He pretty well designed this himself. And the $10,000 budget, he just had to have a bath, a shower, his couch, TV, the big poster over there, his little computer to do work and everything else on. He's got a couple of posters. And we created them little, little small modern lofts is what I decided to go with. You don't have to do lofts. You could just do just a small house for them because I'm going to have them all eat in here with, I mean, heck, look at this kitchen. Oh my God. This kitchen is like hecking huge. So it would be perfect for everyone to eat. And I lost my sinks there for some reason. But anyways, 
this is his home. Definitely a boy. He picked all of these out. He decided that he wanted all the teal. He wanted these posters. He wanted the moon. He wanted an alarm clock. And that's pretty much his house. Alright, on to the next. This would be Harrison's house. Very simple, plain, and I am so sorry about that. Across the way, they're just rude and ignorant sometimes. TV game system. He is definitely a jock. So he's got the big poster of football. He's got a bookshelf, computer to study, hiking trail. He's got the just the bare necessities in his bathroom, shower, toilet, sink. Just the bare necessities. That's all he really ever wanted in there. And of course, he's got his little posters on the wall and everything. He's got a couple of signed ones. But this is basically his his home for the duration. I mean, it's plain, simple, and to the point. This one, wait, no. This one, I believe, is, yeah. Okay, this one belongs to little Miss April, who wants to be the fat or is she fashion? Holy heck, I can't even keep track of my own hecking. Yes, she is the one that wants to be fashion. So she's got purple, pinks, she's got Paris, she's got the cute little shower tub, she's got that, she has a cute little vanity, she's got a TV, some flowers. Of course, posters and everything dealing with dealing with um fashion she's got an easel here's her little work desk she's got a bookshelf she's got flowers her macbook and of course that's covering it but go up to her bedroom and here's her bedroom she's got a picture of her, the Eiffel Tower, and she's got anime picture, and she's got oh, more pictures. And of course, you can tell she likes the color pur purple. And then she's got this over here, and this is her house. And now we are going to go with, oh shoot, dang nabbit, Reese's house. Reese's house is simple, he loves art. And he's simple. He doesn't have a big TV like most of the rest of them does. He has a shower, bath, all that good stuff like they would. He's got a big bookshelf. He's got a couple of pictures, his computer. He's got an easel to paint. And his bedroom is very simple and to the point. And... That's the way he likes it. So, that's his place. And now we're going to go over here, and this is Michelle's place. And she's got a game. Okay, because she's the gamer. She's the gamer of the bunch, so of course she has to have a console, and she's in. She's got a little Sim Bob. Bob's. Plum Blobs. Oh my gosh, I cannot talk. She's got a shower and all that good stuff. There's her computer and everything. And then we're going to take her upstairs, which she has a little different. She has her little dresser, but then she has a TV that is angled towards the bed. So she has two TVs. Why? I don't know. But last but not least, we are going to go to Christy, who really doesn't care about TV much. I mean, as you can see, she's got a tiny little itty bitty one. She's got places to sit, a bookshelf, pictures. She's got shower tub and all that. Her desk area is simple. And then we go upstairs and we see a bunch of beautiful paintings. She's got an art tube there and she's got her easel up here. 
So this is her house. So that is all of the houses. And, well, I should actually take you through Tori and Luke's house now. Shouldn't and I? Okay, so this is their kitchen. It is hecking, hecking huge. I mean, they have a huge kitchen, two stoves, a bunch, an ice cream maker, popcorn maker, toaster, uh, microwave, coffee pot, cups, all of the above, a bunch of stuff, and then a big dining, a big island to eat at. And then the one I, the original, freaking, um, the original stand that I had right here, that or the fireplace that I had right here that I wanted, for some reason got deleted, so I had to go with this one, which really sucks, but here is their living room, which is nice and little cozy, because the, because the kids only come in to eat dinner and everything, and so it's nice, little cozy, they got pictures up. And they got a nice TV, flowers, you have the laundry room, you have a bathroom, which I will have to add sinks back in for some reason. Oh, goodness. Okay, now you come up to the upstairs where all the cool stuff happens. Okay, this is Tori's office. And everything was very beautiful, purple, tell she loves purple. You head straight across the hall. This is Luke's office. It's simple, clean, to the point. He wouldn't have had this if it wasn't for Tori. Um, bathroom, have Tori's art room, the, the workout room, their bedroom their bathroom, and a hecking walk-in closet. So, now with all those, with all of that stuff done, all of it done, I'm going to send the girl, them, to their houses, and they're going to get started on their homework, and everything else and what not let's see April this is your house okay Harrison this is your house Christopher this is your house Luke and Tori you can come here So they're all going to where they need to be. I think I'm going to have Tori start cooking some meals. That way she has them prepped for when the kids... Okay, you can do your homework. Do your homework. Uh, are you in yours? Yes, you are. Do your homework. You're in yours. You can do your home. Oh my goodness. Do your homework. Okay, you do your homework. You do your homework. Christopher, you do your homework. Now, are all of you working on homework? Yes, you are. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. So, we're going to have him, we're going to have Luke come up here, and he is going to practice his programming skills. We're going to come down here and check on Tori. Luke runs an awesome major business and technology. And so Tori does work with him, but right now at this point in time, they think that taking care of all these little kidlins are, these little simulins are the best idea and the best thing to do. 
set curfew for nine. Oh. All right, please do not burn that. Do not catch the house on fire, please, even though we are rich. Oh, Tori, why do you do that? Oh, my child, my child, my child, my child. Why, 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 why? Why? But this is pretty much The Sims, and I think that they are... I think they are going to have a good life once we can get them on the right track. And everything, I think that we are going... I, th I definitely think that we are going... They're going to have really good... I don't even know what the heck happened. Oh, alrighty then. Maybe it was... Nope. Oh, she's sad. Why? Oh, temper tantrum. Stop being a drama... Well, I can't say stop being a drama queen because you are a drama queen. So I really cannot tell you to stop being... Holy cow, she's done with her homework already? Okay, okay, I still don't know why it's doing that. Wow. Okay, so for you, I will have you go paint. Do a classic painting. And then I will go check on your other, um, let's see practice programming because we need to get his grades up. Hmm. Let's see, what are you doing? Are you done with your homework? Oh, Take a bubble bath, baby. Take a bubble bath. And then we can start to on your skills with that for sure. You will probably just Honestly, I don't know if she can actually join the fashion career yet. Not until she becomes an adult, I don't think. No, babysitter, barista, fast food employee, manual labor, and retail. Okay. So, yeah, not until she gets her grades up before she can do that. So, she got her homework done. So, let's go have her, no, no, no practicing programming. No practicing programming. Um, let's see, what should we have you do? What should we have you do? Oh, goodness gracious. Okay. Purchase books. Okay, no, we want skills, we want baking, we'll do that, we'll do charisma, why not, we'll just do all of them, and then, I know Tori and them will want them, so it'll be good, fishing techniques, Luke would like that, fitness, Harrison will like those, gardening, definitely, 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 oh my goodness, guitar, da da da, 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 da da all right, so I think we are pretty well getting to the point where we are, yes, programming, especially rocket science is a good one, video gaming, violin, of course. Wellness, no. Writing, yes. Um, that's it. 
All right, so let's have her open. Let's have her do. Da da da. No. 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 You know what? Let's that. Let's have her do that. Uh huh. What are you doing, sweetheart? Oh, sad painting. Oh, sweetie pie. What are you doing? Oh, yes, you are programming. Wait, 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 wait. What are you? Okay. Okay. Never mind. Never mind at all. Never mind. And I'm controlling them all at once and I know I shouldn't. So I think the first one that we will control is Christy and then we will control the rest of them later. So we will con control Christy right now until tomorrow. Until the next. We'll start with controlling Christy. When we come back and for the second episode, we will start with controlling Christy and work our way down. So if you guys like this video, show that like button some love. If you haven't subscribed yet, slam that subscribe button. Be sure to hit the notification bell next to it so you can get notified for when I upload. Be sure to follow me on my social media sites, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter for all updates, all silly, random, and weird things that I post and future giveaways. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.